It is the Saturday before Fabulous Fords here and we're at the K1 Speed in Anaheim. I know I have these little red marks because of my glasses, they fit a little tight, but Sunshine is currently getting washed. Uh, that's uh, our friends over at GQ, there's Marley. <laughs> Marley over there eating some Lay's. <laughs> Max is gonna come any second here and I don't know what the audio is gonna be like because we got a freeway right behind us and they've got their pressure washer, but there's already a couple Shelby's and a Hellcat here that are just waiting for uh, Max to get here to start washing them. Um, and then, like I said, we're at the K1 Speed in Anaheim, so they're also gonna be racing go-karts uh, and Fabulous Fords is gonna be tomorrow. So, color on this blue one is pretty cool. It's a satin, almost metallic uh, blue, like a, a nice royal blue. It's actually really cool. I like that one. And then we've got Mr. Lee here this uh gt350 these are both gt350s and then we got the hellcat secretly i want one so let's try this again shout out to benny for the little mix up here uh but now we're at actually at the irvine location and there's a lot more cars here getting washed and taken care of including joker there's a whole lineup of people from uh norcal socal everybody's out here just you know getting their cars washed and uh, some of them are getting ready to go inside go-kart racing. So it'll be cool. Look at Max over there being a boss. He's being a boss, but he doesn't know that the real bosses are over here sitting down. Huh? Huh? But see the thing, baby, the thing that Max doesn't know is that the real boss shit is happening right here. We're literally <laughs> just watching them all work from our chairs. Supervising. We're supervising. <laughs> I missed the sneeze. <laughs> it's too early for this. For yet another Ford show. Oh, thank you. I've been waiting for that so long. Yeah. Oh. Mike is. Mike. Mike thought Juanito was. I guess. I know. We going to die today. Waiting in line for the car. Well, we're not at the car show yet. We're not still, the car show yet. We're still waiting to get everybody out on the road. Yeah, we're, we're kind of trying to figure this out. There's probably, like, what, 70, 60, 70 cars? No, not that many. 50? Maybe. It's about 50 cars. There's a lot of people. There's a lot. Testosterone is flowing. The revs can be heard. Oh yeah, listen to those. Those Wu Tang's roar. We're going to Fat Ports today, guys. Yes, we are. I can't believe I let you put that in the car. You like it? That's why. It's because I gotta put my face on it. <laughs> that's why. I don't know if you can hear that whine. That's our good friend Phil. <laughs> oh, careful, Mutang. Just careful.
Angel Stadium, Fabulous Forts, 2019. It's bright, it's hot, there's a lot of cars. Off a little bit and then we'll start doing the show. Okay? This is gonna be the thumbnail for this video and we're taking a look at this now before we can't later. The new GT 500 in person right here, right in front of us right now. What are we doing, AJ? Uh, we're wiping down wheels. Did you see the video I po uh, we posted earlier? No? Alright. It's secret sauce. Okay? We got secret sauce right here. You need a uh, proper uh, knee placement. You know, protect your knees from the heat, from the debris, you know. And then you just get your rag and just kind of get your hand in the barrel. There's some people, I won't name some names, like uh, Flexin and uh, what's the other one? Uh, D, D, uh, GQ uh, auto detailing, they don't see the fine details like this. See, these are fine details that they probably should watch this video and learn something. GQ, flexing, you know, you guys know who you are, you know? I gotta detail these wheels front and back, you know? They just do face, they don't go in, you know? You gotta get in here, you gotta get in here. You know? Then I got a little trick right here. I do this. I go around the spokes like this. You see that? Each and every hey, spoke. that's what I do with my legs when I get out the shower yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, you do that. <laughs> you know? <laughs> well, that's how you do it. You hear that squeaky clean? Just like that. Don't take long. It just takes it just takes dedication. You guys need to be dedicated to this trade, you know? This this uh you know, if you have a car, you need to be dedicated. What was that thing Marley said the other day that this is the only girl you'll get on your knees for? Yeah. <laughs> Apart from Emily, maybe? Just so you guys know, this is a... Uh, her name is Frostbite. Frostbite. She's a cold-hearted bitch. This is my girl right here. She'll bite you. She'll bite you. If you don't treat her right, she'll bite you. Yeah. So I'm sitting here with Chris. He's never watched Game of Thrones. Oh, and uh, and everyone, well, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> Before we get any farther into this conversation, I gotta tell you, I'm in the same boat because I didn't watch Game of Thrones um, for the first seven seasons. Yeah. Okay? okay. It wasn't until Marley introduced me to Game of Thrones where then I watched it and I couldn't stop. So I'm not judging you for not watching it, but this is me telling you right now. Okay. Do make time to watch the show. I will. Because even though it sounds like kind of lame where you have this medieval sort of... Uh, it's not about that. It's just that I've watched the first and second episode of the first season. The, it's the fact that like, it's just so much plot buildup. Like, like, I just kept getting disinterested. That was my issue. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever watched Dragon Ball Z? Yes. Then you have no reason to complain. <laughs> <laughs> Next time on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> it is a fantastic show. Yeah. Game yeah. of Thrones. So yeah, I know. Give it's, it don't don't give it like the first three episodes. I literally rewatched episode one. 
three times already. And I just like, after like, I try to do it. I try to push through it, but I guess I just gotta start like at episode three or something. Just like, I don't know, figure out what's wrong. You know what you should do? What? Start at the last episode of season seven. And no, then, and no. then, well, hold up, hold up, hold up. Because here's the thing. It's so far into the future that you don't, you're not gonna know what the hell is going on. Yeah. That now you're gonna wanna rewatch everything just to get to that point. I guess that works. Yeah, but I don't know. But what if, what if I remember? What if that's ingrained in my memory and I already know what's gonna happen? Just do it. Alright. Alright. I'll do it for you. I'll do it yeah, for the do it for me. I'll do, do it, it for, for the engine base. Shout out, shout out to Chris for doing it for the engine base. <laughs> I'll do it. Like Nike. <laughs> Marley loves this one, huh? Look at you being a diva with your umbrella. Look at that. Mm. Woo! Am I sunburnt? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. I can't I can't tell. No, you're burnt. Yeah? Oh fuck me. Well, another year, another fabulous Fords. This was the first time at Angel Stadium. What do you think? It's it, it wasn't that bad. The weather wasn't that bad. It wasn't as bad as last year, but it's hot. Yeah, it's hot. But everybody's starting to clear out. As you guys can see, a lot of spots are, well, you can't see past the umbrella, but a lot of spots are just empty at this point. And everybody's just kind of taking off slowly. And uh, so are we. 